guys, welcome back to Shannon Gibson Art and Designs. And today, guys, doing something a little bit different, a little home DIY-ish, if you want to call it. So I have these gorgeous, cute little wine glasses here. They're almost like shot glasses. I believe they're about two ounces. So like shot glass wine glasses. They got these really great bottoms on them without the dip that you get in the center, which makes it a lot easier to do the dip. So what I'm doing is a metallic, metallic dip today, guys, using um, Artist Law Flow Acrylic Black, Folk Art 14 Karat Gold, Artist Law Flow Acrylic White, and this new DecoArt Americana multi-surface meta multi-surface metallic silver that I got a few weeks ago that I have not used on camera yet. It is absolutely stunning, super shimmery, very transparent, and I love it. I can't wait to get going. So anyways, first time trying this. Um, can't be too difficult. Worst comes to worst, I'll wipe it off and try it again. But let's get going, guys. Okay, guys, so I just have some parchment paper here. I love it. I use this all the time. The paint doesn't stick to it. It's easy to peel off if you want to use it for jewelry or anything that you want to put it on. Um, so I'm just going to put some dabs here. I'm going to try two variations to see which one I like first. And I'm going to start off with the black puddle here. I don't need a lot. Those are only tiny. And then I'm going to go in with the gold. I'm not going to use white in all of them. Like I said, I'm going to do a couple variations. And I'm so excited to try this gorgeous silver. Let's give it quite a bit. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, guys, is just give this a swirl. Just like that. All right. So let's hope this one turns out gorgeous. Actually, guys. Looks like I need a little bit more because I don't want to move this around. I want the bottom to fit the base. Perfect. And we should be good. And I'm just going to lift that up slowly. Oh, wow, guys. Oh, I love that. That is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Don't worry, guys. I will make sure that I show you the total. I'm just going to flip that upside down. Now, guys, I'm just going to re-dip. Because there was quite a bit of paint. And again, absolutely gorgeous. And do you see that sparkle from that Decorate Americana metallic silver? Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Gorgeous. Okay, so the next variation. Oh, I don't know. They're so pretty. I'm just wondering if I should continue. You know what? I think I'm going to ignore the white guys. And now I'm just going to do a puddle of the gold. And again with the black. I'll just give a couple of lines to it. Now, with that gorgeous silver. And once again, I'm just going to swirl this around, give it a nice design. I like that. And here we go. Number three. I'm not swirling it, guys. I am just picking it up straight. You don't want to swirl it because you're going to smudge it and blend your colors. And uh, you don't want to do that. And look at that, guys. That one is, oh my gosh, my hand is shaky. Absolutely stunning as well. Flip that over. And this one here got a little bit heat up a bit, so we're going to just roll with the color wherever. And 
actually not going to waste here. I'm going to bring some of this gold in and do a little design here. I'm going to put that right there. And again, absolutely stunning. So sorry, my focus is not working right for you guys. But again, I will make sure that you guys see them in full once they dry. Okay guys, so I'll be back with the dried result. These turned out fabulous. Very classy. Very sparkly. Silver is just stunning, guys. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. I love them. I absolutely love them. So very simple to do, guys. Easy dip. Something if you want to jazz up um, any wine glasses in your home and make a simple display, home decor display. Perfect. I'm probably going to varnish and seal the ends of the bottoms of them, and that will be that. We'll see you in the next pour. Bye.